Number nine. So it looks like we have an isosceles trapezoid. We have the area of 98,700. We have the two bases, the two parallel bases, and we have to solve for the height. So to do this, we can use the formula. Area equals one half times the sum of the bases multiplied by the height. And we can just plug in values that we already have. We have the area, A, and we have B1 and B2. Now we have to do is solve for H. So 98,700 equals 1 half times 294 plus 640 times H. So to solve for H, we just multiply both sides by 2. and then divide by the sum of the bases. This should give us the height. So let's see, 2 times 98,700, and then divide that by, divide that by 294 plus 640. And you get, rounding to three six figs, you get 211. All right, so now for number 10, Looks like we have a rectangle, we have the area, we have one of the sides. So this is one of the simplest formulas that we're gonna have, it's just area is equal to length times width. So our area is 7.88, our length is 5.34, and our missing value, which I'll say is the width, we'll just call that W. And so to solve for W, it's just 7.88 divided by 4.34, and let's see what that is. 7.88 divided by 4.34. And we get round into three, three sig figs, that's going to be 1.82. So this is going to be 1.82. All right, so these, these geometries are usually pretty simple, usually just one step. Uh, just as long as you know the formula, you can solve these. But yeah, if you have any questions from other tests, make sure to leave a comment and I'll make a video with a solution. With that said, if you enjoyed the video, leave a like and subscribe. This has been Investigative Math, and I'll see you next time.